Hey guys, how you doing today? It's me, Kelly. So today we're going to do an art journal page. And right now I am using a um, my old webcam from back in the day when I first started because my other one, apparently um, a lot of people are having problems hearing me or it sounds like uh, muffled or discombobulated or the picture is not close enough. So I'm going to try this and we're going to see if this is any better. So please excuse if it's not bright enough or anything like that. I'm trying to get it, uh, you know, up to par. So today I'm going to do something that I normally do not do uh, on video because it takes a long time for me to do. But it's I go through magazines and I have probably a stack this big of stuff for magazines with words and pictures and all kinds of stuff. Um, so I thought today let's do an art journal page. Now this is my art journal that I go on and kind of gesso over pages that uh, I didn't like or throw extra paint on. And today I chose this page, which I went over and I love the way the colors come through. And I have my handy dandy Elmer's extreme glue stick. You can use an, an Avery disappearing uh, glue one or Mod Podge or whatever, but I'm going to try to make this as easy and fast as possible. I do enjoy using Mod Podge um, matte, but today we're just going to go with it. Okay, so I ripped out some pictures and I'm going to show you briefly some of them that I picked out and what I chose. I love these. I love these. I love these, but these aren't going to go with what I'm doing today. And so I'm going to set those aside. I do, I'm digging this. So I'm going to use this. And then I have some words that I just am digging, like a crack in the sky, awakening at the crossroads, self-care practices uh, for realists. And I read it like that because I'll probably cut it and put self-care. This is two words uh, for fun, because why not? Um, inner outer worlds, inner life care of the soul. Um, I don't know exactly what I liked about this, but I took out the words. Come here. Not, I will take a bath, but I like the bubbles. <laughs> so I don't know. And then I did these few little, um, you know, music and a cup of tea and of course a little kitty cat. So, and then this, find your North star, let the gravity of your star pull you into your dreams. So that, that's two things for me, plus the picture. So this I won't use today. I'm having a hard time deciding. I'm going to use this. I might add a cat. I don't know. Cup of tea, maybe some music. This is not going to be a realist realistic kind of thing. It's just going to be really a page for me when I open it to be reminded. Care of the soul, I like. Crack in the sky, I love. Inner life, I'm not real sure about. Waking at the crossroads, I really dig. And I also dig, like I said, find your North Star. And I love this, but I'm going to cut it apart if I use it. So now this is, <laughs> this is why I don't do a video. Okay. So I really love the way the sky is like the way this looks in here. I don't even know if I want to add any paint because I really just love the ethereal kind of, I don't even know if that's the right word, the way it looks. So I'm going to leave it. I'm not going to put paint or anything on it. Like I originally had thought. So what I'm going to do is take these down at the moment. And my suggestion to you is to scan these in. Okay. Um, now words, you know, quotes and words, you can go through magazines and cut out different words so you can place them to make your quotes or whatever. So, I mean, to spend all the time doing that, unless there's something that you really dig, I don't normally do, but like these pictures like this, 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 I will scan in and then I can print it out whether it's inkjet or laser doesn't matter. I use my inkjet and I don't have any problems. And then you always have it um, because I'm going to cut this and because it doesn't fit. So, you know, I went, I scanned this in because I love it. Now, if I do it this way, 
I like it, but she's looking, I don't know. She's looking, unless she's looking for her North Star. So that's a thought. And I like the cloudage. Then if I do it this way to the page, she's still looking at the North Star. And I really like this in here. So that's probably what I'm going to do. And what I'm going to do is take my nail and just kind of give me an idea, or you could fold it, where you want to cut it. So it's probably where I'll do it. And then you have, see, because I can save this and that'll be good. And I can even stack it as a mountain. I can do whatever I want with it because it's mine. All right. Okay. And like I said, I'll save this because that's just how I am. And because I'm not going to paint the background, I'm just going to kind of go with it and open my glue stick. I have no idea. A piece of paper. Okay. And then I'm going to go in. I like just to really go around the edges to make sure it sticks and I'll do it down where I'm going to stick it and then we'll set her in. And you know, something that I didn't do on here, like I said, I would probably get decorative scissors and, or tear this and have this a little bit of a, um, you know, kind of decorative thing. Look at me go. <laughs> Now think about doing this with ATC cards. Maybe you're finding things that, uh, you know, or could fit smaller or that you draw, but I mean, look how cute. I love it. And like I said, I can even like cut this out. And then I can draw, maybe that's what I'll do. Let's try it. If it doesn't work, it just doesn't work. So I'm going to cut this out. I am not a fussy cutter because of my hands and because I'm blind and I'm old now and I can't see anything. So I'm not going to, you know, stress and be like, well, I'm not going to cut this out or use it because I can't see. No, we're going for it. And if there's a little white left over, it's okay. Or I cut some of it off. It's just an art journal page. Now I'm going to cut this out a little bit. I can see I have a little bit of white here. Okay. Okay. Please don't write. You should have done that earlier. Okay. Or that your desk's a mess. Leave me alone. <laughs> so maybe I'll put it over there, but I'm not going to glue it yet because I'm not real sure. And I don't know what exactly I'm going to do over here, but probably cut that off, but I can take, I could do this and then do like little tree trunks or flower stems or whatever. If I want to kind of add to that a little bit, let me move in just a tad to see if you guys can see it's kind of hard because the stems are thin. Can you see? And because it's got a little shine to it, I probably should turn my autofocus off. Okay. Just so it doesn't go back and forth. Okay. So that's kind of something. So now do I want to put a sun? Do I want to just kind of do a sun or am I digging this? I think I am. Now, because the words are here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this as close to the word as I can and then go this way and then I'll trim it so it looks better. But I mean, what are you going to do? Sometimes that happens and that really burns my butt. <laughs> These magazine people need to be more, you know, knowing what I want. So if I put this here and this goes over here, we're going to cut this off for now. There's no reason to have it. And I'll take this on, set you there. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut this out here 
so it has little points and like kind of around here a little bit cut these little orange things off and then around here a little bit not too much i'm not gonna fussy cut in here because that's gonna be way too uh much for me let's see if that helps a little bit and uh so yeah so let me undo that real quick how was your guys's weekend your mother's day Mine was very quiet. My daughter worked, Dave worked. So it was just me and my dogs. <laughs> and then I made, um, I made dinner, uh, for Emily and Dave and Emily's boyfriend. I made, I have, I made a video. I just, I forgot. Gosh darn it. I forgot to do the ending part, but I think I might be able to, I think I might cut this off too be able to, uh, salvage it. So we'll see. I have to, I have leftovers and I'm bringing it to Emily for dinner today. Cause she's working a 12 hour shift and, uh, she wants me to make more cauliflower rice. So maybe I can show you a final, final thing. I mean, I still could show the recipe anyway. What it was, was it was meatballs, uh, in a sauce, just plain old gluten-free sugar-free sauce, uh, that I homemade. And, cauliflower rice. Like I cooked, uh, oh, it was really, really, I was surprised because I thought, oh, she's not going to eat this because she's so picky, but it came out really good. No cheese. So it's dairy free, gluten free, sugar free, which sounds yummy, doesn't it? <laughs> but it really did come out good. So I got to take my glasses off. I cannot see. Yeah. So I have a majority of it and I made, also I made which I didn't do a video for. I did show it gluten-free and sugar-free processed sugar-free. I used coconut sugar brownies, but I used sugar-free chocolate chips. It's a whole thing, but it, it's not that expensive. I've been trying to work it. Uh, it's really hard to try to do keto and the paleo and the sugar-free grain. For, oh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to have to have her write it down because I always forget everything of what it is, but it's helping her. And uh, that's all that one could ask for. So I will sit and relearn and learn how to do things for her. I'm obviously not going to cut all this because <laughs> who are we kidding? I can't, but I could do a little bit where it's a little bit more fringy. So yeah, so that was yesterday's Mother's Day. Dave is on a project that he has to finish and he's just been working, working, working. And my sister had Mother's Day, although, and she asked if I wanted to come, but I, honestly, Mother's Day, after losing my son and with Emily working, it's, it's a rough, this month is rough because it's Mother's Day. It's my son's birthday. He would have been... May 29th, he would have been 29, 28. Oh gosh. Yeah. 28. And then, um, so that's rough. He died when he was 19. So we have that. <laughs> and then Emily working, it, it was just, what was the point? I don't want to go down my sisters and, you know, with my mom and, I mean, they understood, but it, it's just, it's hard. It's really hard. It, even after eight years, it's hard. All right. Now let me just do over here real quick rather than talking about what was me, but it was, like I said, I'm not complaining. It was a good day, but Hey, as the kids get older and life, you know, life doesn't care that it's mother's day or birthdays or it just doesn't matter to anybody but me. Right. Or to your, you, if you're going through something, I'm going to cut that off. And that's just the way it is. I could sing a song to that right now, but I won't. <laughs> okay. I think that'll be all, all I do for this one. Get off. Okay. Is it perfect? No. but it will be good 
for that. You know, I think you, you get the point. I don't know why this looks like it's... I think that's why I quit using it. Because it's like I can't get... If I put light on it, look, it blows it out. And then if I turn the light off and I have it on, like, right light, right sound. Okay. Quit whining, Kel. All right. Okay. So, and you see what I did? I have this and I flipped it this way because I am horrible and I will forget like what way it's supposed to go. And when you're using your glue stick gently, not like I'm doing and ripping through it because it will rip. It's show wheel, believe me. And I've had to glue it after it ripped. Okay. That should be good. Now I can go over this with my Mod Podge, uh, mat so it sticks down so if you're nervous or you know this is just to kind of tack it down for me um so you don't have to be too too worried i mean like these little edges i'll put a little of this glue on just because they're sticking up just a little bit there you go see There you go. So let me show you because I don't know how well you're going to be able to see it. And we have that so far. And let me cut this. And then this little loopy right there. I mean, collaging using magazines is fantastic because I am a magazine lover and I'll leave that on. And what happens is I have so many magazines sitting around and what am I going to do? Throw them away. You can't take them to Goodwill. You can't sell them or do anything unless, you know, you sell them privately. And, uh, so I've been cutting them apart, cutting them apart. Just, you know, to repurpose them because I hate, I don't want to throw them away. So I think I'm going to put this over on this side. I don't know why I'm feeling it over there, but I am. So, so yeah, so I'm going to look at my video that I recorded and see if I could put it up. It's only literally like going to be three minutes. Cause it's quick. I just talk about it, but I, you know, and then I do know that you guys keep asking for me to do, to write the recipes down and I am going to do that. Um, I just keep forgetting on my website, but I am, cause I, I know you guys want them and I try to explain them the best I can in my videos, but look, we all know who we're talking about here. All right. So we have that and then I'm going to take do I want my charcoal? I am so into charcoal right now. It's not even funny. But what I'm going to do is kind of pretend like that's a tree. So I'll kind of go down and double it. Like I said, I'll put Mod Podge on everything. Not a big deal. It's just my thing. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't have to be your thing. Don't do it. <laughs> I can have, like what I like. And then I'll just kind of. I see some comments on people's videos and I think, good gosh, like, first of all, how do you even have the nerve to say something rude to somebody else like that when they're taking the time to do it? And most of the time I ignore things and it must be that time of the month, but people write stuff to, on the, some of the, not, I mean, look, 1% of them are negative. The rest, 99% are absolutely positive comments and I love them. And you guys are so inspiring to me and loving and accepting. And it is just everything to me, your emails, your comments, everything. Um, and, and it's fantastic. 
But that 1% sometimes is like, did your mother not teach you manners? Like, move on. And then I look and they don't even have videos. They don't make videos. So how are you judging me knowing, do you know what I mean? And when I, I watch a lot of videos lately um, and I see some people even comment and I'm like, oh, girl or boy or whomever person move on. Don't be so rude. We have enough negativity in this world and you're just adding more and spreading more. Why? Why? Oh, it drives me bananas. That's all I'm going to say about it. But thank you to the 99% of you guys who are absolutely lovey, loving and, and beautiful and my odd, my odd kindred souls out there. And I just am thankful. I thank you. I just thank you. Okay. So enough of that might start crying while I'm doing this. Okay. So, I mean, this is as basic as I'm getting. I, I love doing this basic. Yes. But I love it because it just doesn't take, if you're having a bad day and you don't have maybe a lot of imagination going on or a lot of, you know, this is kind of what you want to do. I kind of like care of the soul. I think that's what I'm going to do. And I'll just cut it out square. I don't even worry how perfect or imperfect it is. Because that's what this is about. And I think it needs to go right there. So I'm going to do a little line. Oh, we'll do a little line. <laughs> that's what she said. Nobody? Just me? Okay. Oh, come on, baby. Being a little rough, Cal. Being a little rough. Making stupid jokes that only you get. As Dave and Emily say, not funny. Oh my God, come on. Oh, now my dogs start barking. Okay, so that is literally my page. Let me move it back a little bit. Maybe you can see the whole thing. I'm going to have to have Dave check these settings for me. But anyway, there it is. I mean, look how cute out of a, out of a magazine. So that is my art journal page for today using collage and out of a magazine and an art journal page that you just can really, literally, if you have a white page, throw a back deck ground on, you see very simple and I love it. It came out really, really good. So I'm happy with that. <laughs> so let me know what you guys think down below. Let me know about the camera and all. Please be kind. And, uh, you know, like I said, collaging with magazine is so much fun. And the page came out really, really good. And you can really go, make sure you close your glue stick. You can really go on and on. You know, you can add birds. And I had a stencil here. Let me just show you because I just if you need like extra and you know, you could put birds or, I mean, you really can just have fun. So I am just very blessed. You guys make me so ecstatic and so happy. And as always, please be kind to each other. You never know what battle somebody else is fighting. Please be kind. And I, I, I'm just very, very happy. Um, for those of you who are interested, I put out a new sticker they're die cut stickers, or you can get regular stickers, uh, with my odd girl. And it says stay odd. Uh, I will put a link to it down below and a link. I'm going to try to link it at the end of this, but probably down below. Um, just go check it out. Uh, if you're interested, I'd appreciate it. I would love it. I would be so thankful if you bought it. Um, trying to make them as inexpensive as possible. I'm also going to be trying to make some at home. Um, you know, so that I can even do cheaper. So we shall see. We shall see. So yeah, stay odd guys. And, uh, I just, oh, I just love you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.